Hello, today we are going to talk about the Glow Research OptiGlow ACE plasma system and the operation of the system. The system is designed for up to four inch wafers and can handle various different types of substrates. The OptiGlow ACE system is used primarily in FA labs, it's used for ashing, cleaning, plasma activation, plasma cleaning, pre bonding applications, PDMS. Uh, etching polyamide, uh, perylene, we also have etched oxides and nitrides and remove different types of, of protective coverings on ICs like uh, uh, packages and opening up packages. The OptiGlow ACE system has automatic tuning at 13.56 megahertz, has a Pirani gauge for the vacuum and can strike a plasma as low as 10 watts or as high as 150 watts. You can adjust the power in one watt increments. The system is found to be extremely flexible and extremely reliable. Now we're going to start the system. First you press the AC on button. You'll notice that there's a timer down here and you can set the timer in minutes, minutes, seconds, and seconds. After the process is complete, the system will shut off. Then you press your vacuum. That will bring the door in. Notice that in the hinge here, it has a dynamic set offset for so that the wall of the door will go directly in and will not pinch the O-ring. So you'll notice that we're down at pressure reading of 0.18. So when you do a crossover pressure of 0.35 tor, you'll ignite a plasma. Typically, it's a good idea over here on your flow meters to operate around mid-range. So you notice on this one, we have a very, it's very high. And then on this one, it's very low. So we'll bring that one up. And you'll notice that as we allow for more gas to come in, the pressure will go up. Over here on the selector switch, this is for pressure. There's the RF set point. So we've set the RF power at, in this case, 100 watts. The reflected power is 0.5 watts, which is extremely good. And then the actual power going into the system is right at 100 watts or 99 watts. So we give you a reading of not only of what you set it at, but also what the, what the uh, amount of power going into the system would be. You can adjust your power over here. And like I say, you can adjust it up to 150 or it can strike a plasma as low as 10 watts. You can stop the process by hitting the process abort, which we'll do in just a moment. But you notice right here, we have the indicator lights that, uh, LED indicator lights that tells you about the interlocks, the vacuum, the pressure, the gas flow, and the RF on. Glow Research makes the entire system from the chamber to the RF generator, to the matching network, the matching network is an automatic tuning matching network and it, it tunes extremely well. So now if we want to stop the process, we simply hit process abort. If you want to start it again, press process start, the system starts up again. Some people would like to purge the system and get out. If they're operating with an oxygen uh, plasma, they want to make sure that they get all the residual air out of the system. So you can go through a series of tests here and, 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 and back and forth to ignite the plasma and then stop the plasma and then that will purge the system of any air that might be in the system. So once again we'll go ahead and start the process and you can see the plasma in the chamber itself. It is important to bring your gases in at about 10 psi so you should have your gases regulated to about 10 psi. It comes into the back of the system and it's very easy to see how it hooks up. There is a switch on the back of the system that needs to be in the up position. This is a breaker switch and safe for safety. The system is CE marked and tested. It's a very safe system. We ship these all over the world. It can plug into standard 110 or 220 outlets and uh, it, it's a uh, uh, once again, as I said, it's a very reliable system. The system will vent back to atmosphere after you press the vacuum or stop the process. 
and press the vacuum. Once you're able to open the door, you can retrieve your sample. So just to run this in reverse, you would want to put your samples in the in this chamber, then close the door. I might add that on this particular shelf right here, this is a powered shelf. So if you put your sample on this shelf, it will have more of a RIE effect and maybe a little bit more aggressive processing depending upon what type of samples you're running. If you put your samples either here or here, they would be on the grounded electrode. You can see that there's a rail on the back of the system that attaches to either the power or the ground. So you put your samples in, you would close your door, you would hit the vacuum. You'll notice that it sucks in. Once again, there's a dynamic offset on the hinge right here to suck straight in. You'll notice that the once you hit around 125, hit the crossover point of 0.35, you, you depress your process start button and automatically the system will stop start. And you can see the flow of the gases over here. Those can be adjusted however you want them. After the process is timed out, the system will automatically shut off, or if you choose, you can hit the process abort, thus stopping the process, and then come over here and press vacuum. That will close the vacuum valve, and now that's allowing the system to vent back to atmosphere. The system has a, uh, a, a prefixed orifice that allows for a softer venting of the chamber, so if you have light uh, things in your, in your in your process chamber, such as maybe light samples or feathers or something of that nature, uh, it, it won't disturb them. So after you wait about, uh, about a minute and a half, you should be able to open the this front door right here. That is the operation of the Glow Research OptiGlow ACE system. This system also has a little brother or a little sister. It's called the OptiGlow 75 that is arranged at 100 kilohertz and it sells for a little bit less money. We also have other plasma systems made of quartz and other larger systems that can work with 8 inch substrates or 8 inch square substrates. Thank you for your attention and your interest in the OptiGlow ACE system. Uh, please know that we are at your service. Thank you.